Here's a short video where we're going to see how to merge multiple purchase orders. Taking a look at our purchase order list, I can see that the first and third purchase orders here are for the same supplier, but they're still pending. In other words, I haven't sent them off yet. What I'd like to do is merge these before sending the email. In order to merge purchase orders, we need to check four things. All purchase orders need to be for the same supplier. They can have no inventory received. They cannot have the invoice received and they all have to be for the same warehouse. So to show all the purchase orders just for one supplier, click the supplier name. The next thing we need to do is filter by warehouse. So let's choose the main warehouse, which now gives us a button where we can merge purchase orders. Let's select the two we want to merge and then click merge. This deletes the existing purchase orders and creates a new one. But all the notes and the attachments from the previous purchase orders will be copied across. So let's click OK, and then we're taken to the new purchase order where we can see all the items on it. Note that if the two separate purchase orders have got the same SKUs, these SKUs will not be combined into the same line because you might have had different prices for them. So what we'd recommend there is you sort this by SKU and then combine any duplicate lines. To sort lines on your order by SKU, go to Setup, Sales, Sales Settings, and then choose SKU from the product or item display order and this applies to both sales and purchases. So there you have it, that's how to merge purchase orders. Don't forget they need to be for the same supplier, no inventory received, no invoice received and for the same warehouse. If your supplier is sending you a single purchase invoice to cover multiple purchase orders, then the best approach is actually to receive that purchase invoice against the separate purchase orders without merging them and it's quite likely that you will already have received the inventory so you can't merge them anyway. There's a separate video that shows you how to receive a single purchase invoice against multiple purchase orders.